So this might be the craziest video we made up to this point on Lucid Motors stock, as there was just so much insane stuff happening recently that it completely changed the game for the company. And we're talking of course about the merger now being complete and exactly what that means for Lucid in the future. So what we are going to do today is give you an updated insight into what is happening to the now ticker symbol LCID and break down exactly whether it is still a buy at the end. And as the analysis in the video is absolutely crucial to consider before buying the stock, make sure to stay tuned. But before we jump right in, just hit that subscribe button down below. And as we'll keep you updated on breaking news and awesome trading opportunities every single day, subscribing would not only help us but also you. So there is really no excuse for not smashing the subscribe button, it's free, and you can always unsubscribe if you feel so. Alright, let's jump right into the definitely biggest story. So Lucid shareholders finally approved the long-awaited merger between Churchill Capital and Lucid on Friday. And as there has been way too much drama around Churchill Capital and Lucid's merger process, with the merger finally complete, traders can leave the SPAC issues behind and start concentrating on the business we have to talk about now. And in the case of Lucid Motors, we're looking at an especially amongst investors extremely popular EV company. And as the merger is now complete, it is crucial to take a look at the initial reasons for the spikes in January again, with most of them, next to the hype among retail traders which we'll talk about in a second, being able to get traced back to the hope that Lucid can actually compete in the super competitive EV space. But now that Lucid is trading on its own, it should get the same sort of attention that rivals like Tesla and NEO do, making the company now ready to make its push to dominate the EV market. However, given the staggering numbers achieved by companies like Tesla, as well as all of the legacy auto manufacturers transitioning to and investing substantially in electric vehicles, some concerns are understandable at first. But Lucid Motors actually does something that almost none of the other new EV companies are trying. It focuses on an entirely different opportunity than the majority of the large players in the space, the luxury market. So with cars like the Lucid Air Dream Edition, which starts at $169,000, the company can target a completely different group of customers than for example Tesla, while simultaneously competing in a segment where nearly no other company currently is. But the fact that the leaders in the EV space are still far ahead of Lucid Motors is critical to consider for our prediction at the end. In fact, no car has been formally delivered to a client, leaving investors to rely solely on the company's management's assurances for the time being. But this will change soon, as the first models are literally getting ready right now to be on the way to the massive amounts of people who have already preserved and bought a car. Another super important thing to consider however is the incredible hype amongst investors, especially retail traders. And as we've seen it a ton in January, the potential here is astonishingly high. So here is what to expect next, Lucid anticipates a substantial increase in manufacturing over the next five years, including the release of an SUV in 2023, and sales of around 48,000 vehicles in 2023. And, given Lucid's own estimates for the next five years, it's easy to see why investors are so enthusiastic about the company's future. Nonetheless, there is a lot of competition as well as legacy automakers that are shifting gears and committing to more EV-heavy product portfolios, as we've discussed on the channel before. So to sum it all up, Lucid Motors definitely has immense potential. And although we initially recommended waiting for the first actual cars to be delivered and the following either negative or positive news before buying or adding more stocks, new gains are actually very likely now, as the technical setup is also perfect. And with the merger now being complete, there definitely be a new wave of investors becoming interested in the stock with more people also going in for the long term. If retail traders however continue to hype the stock up as well, even some short-term growth is extremely likely. Alright, with that being it for today's video, thank you very much for watching. If you like this video and want to support our mission of providing free financial information to everyone here on YouTube, please ensure you're subscribed and definitely consider leaving a like. As mentioned before, it really means the world to us. Thanks a lot and see you next time.